听到声音了吗？静静的，马路上的车，大家都在忙碌着。我喜欢安静的训练。现在大家伙还没来，我来的早一点，开始练。今天算是有一个最大的强度，接下来就该减减重了。对，你也可以往后一拉。对，扇，扇就抓住轻手。嗯。嗯。可以，我们每个运动员都喜欢 K O， 然后能拿到花红是更好的，对吧？谁都喜欢 make the money， 我一样。还有二十秒。我觉得这场比赛我们很有可能是打满，因为如果你 focus 他和别的选手不太一样，这次我第一次碰到这样子的选手，所以说给我多多少少会有点压力，但是我把这个压力改为是动力。Stop。You guys know UFC. There is no more easy fight. It's about challenge, and all you guys know who is Tony Ferguson. He's a guy that always accepts challenges, and he's a veteran. You know, he's an OG from the sport. And all you guys can expect a great fight. I see his arms getting raised in the air. So I take him for the fight. Not too many people do that, but I take my own hands for the fight. Not because it's cool though. The cut man's the most important job, man. I'm gonna be real. We can make or break a move. And if they're cool with everybody and you got a good hand wrap, you go in there. Confident, pardon my language, but you're confident. You go right in there. Handle business real fast. You know, I've been working with Tony for years now, and and uh, you know, Tony has, you know, he's always looks the same. You no know, matter when it is, he's always feeling. If you ask him, he's feeling. He's like, I feel great. I think this fight's very important, and and sometimes it just takes that one little thing to either to win it or lose it. And I feel that sticking to the basics he has, which are high level, I feel that we could get the job done. One, two, I don't know how to play, man. I'm from Brazil. I play soccer. I think that you can expect your genuine El Cucuy with some more basics. I think. And let's see if that comes true. Because at the end of the day, Tony's gonna walk out there and Tony's Tony. So there's these two muffins, right? You're sitting in the oven. One muffin looks at the other muffin and says, holy it's hot in here. The other muffin says, holy talking muffin. Who said that? Yes. No. Makes you terrible. Don't be scared. <laughs> I just arrived like last night late, so I didn't even sleep, so I'm just here with the guys now, ready to f*** up with them, or, you know, get, get the win, Sati, that's it. See you tomorrow. Good, Mike. Thank you. Tony, I don't know what color fight shorts you would like, good sir? Black. Perfect. That makes it easy. Thank you. There's your left hand, sir. I'm kind of fat. <laughs> Yeah, no, I know, I know it's a weight class up, so we'll have you try it on the yeah, shorts to make sure they fit. 
my hands are bigger than Brock's. You know that? <laughs> you know that? Brock's health? Oh, yeah, but he's got fat meat hooks. Uh, yeah, his, he's got, I think, what it? Three or four XL. XL. He called them lunch boxes or something yeah, like that. Yeah. Brock is the same size on the ground as everybody. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, largest will be it. Cool. Ones. Cool, cool. Winner, winner. Thank you. Yes, sir. Yeah, so tell me about that, man. Like, you've been putting this work in for a while, and you've always consistently kept that elevated level of training there. When you get to, like, master class level, you're still learning, and that's like chess. I played chess for a long time, and my daddy, once in a while, he'll give me a move. But I'm sitting here, and I'm like, man, this, why didn't you tell me this, like, five to, like, ten years ago when we were playing? I'm 38, but now you're talking this move, and I'm, like, learning how to finish better. That's like MMA. It's learning how to like go to Jackson Weeks. It's like going to Wild Card. It's like going to my academy and then mixing it up there. But each time I'm going to other places, I'm learning. I'm picking up how old these guys that did it before because that's experience. And you know what I mean? Everybody wants to be a goat, but I'm a boat. That's the best of all time. Goats come and go, but boats stay float. You quickly? I'll try. You have to be on. Come on, come on. Hey, hey, hey. Johnny Walker. Wait, wait, wait. Man, it's finished, Dave. JW, man. JW. JW. Hello? Yeah. Sign the poster. Come here. You're fast. I'm tired. <laughs> God damn. Looks like you don't even know I'm here. Great. <laughs> you got the suit and the shirt. Yep. Everything ready to go for your trap. Thank you, go. you, sir. No problem. There you go. To feel good, you got to, you know, look good. So we come to this uh, fantastic tailor-made suit place, and then they were kind enough to help us to pick out with this fantastic suit. I really think it's going to make him look fresh, give him that swag that we're looking for. Just don't have him lose anymore, because now we're perfect. <laughs> You're perfect. You're perfect now. <laughs> My fiance and I are uh, traveling from Dallas, Texas. This fight with Irina Aldana is one of the biggest fights uh, of my career. Um, this is going to be kind of the pathway and the doorway to the title for Amanda Nunes. Making my way down to 35 sucks. Um, but it's worth it, man. I'm, I'm here, I'm ready. I've never been more ready in my life for a fight. You know, I'm, I'm excited to show everyone what I've been working on and improving on, and and uh, sparks are gonna fly Saturday. By following these practices, do not accept <laughs> How you guys doing? Good. Yeah. Uh, we'll walk down here to the carousel. They threw D-Rod's name at me. I was like, yeah, we didn't know if we were fighting at 170, so I was on a diet for like two or three days. And then we realized he couldn't make 170 pounds and they wanted to do a catch weight at 180. So I instantly hopped off the diet, got back to living life, and now here we are. I can tap out everybody in your gym. <laughs> I never said I could out wrestle them, though. You never went with me and Vince. You guys are too small. <laughs> oh. Where? Damn. Vince? Come on now. Must we talk about that time in the locker room? I don't want to talk about that. <laughs> <laughs> You know, I used to only want to fight wrestlers at this division because uh, the champ was a wrestler. Now we got a new champ. The new champ's a striker, so any striking fight I can get, I'm happy with. Everybody knows D. Roger striker. On paper, he's a good striker, so got to get out there and show him that uh, this ain't paper. <laughs>